Thanks for joining us for our online service today as we've spent time hearing from John's gospel. And it's been great that as we've seen this familiar miracle, the raising of Lazarus, we've been helped to recognize that it's not just about Lazarus. As we've heard, this miracle is about the identity and power of Jesus, of God's son, showing that he is the resurrection and the life, the one with power over death, who offers hope beyond death. And as we've heard, the identity and power of Jesus as God's son is meant to lead people to believe in Jesus, people like Martha, people like us, so that God might be glorified as we place our trust, our confidence in Jesus, our saviour, the one who isn't just grieved by death or angry at death as we might be, but who has defied death and who will defeat death bringing the hope of new life to us and to all who trust in him. As we finish our time together, let me lead us in praying our church prayer, asking God to help us to live out what we've heard from his word today, these incredible things that Jesus has done for us. And so let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you that through Jesus' death and resurrection, you have rescued us from the dominion of darkness. Thank you that you have brought us into the kingdom of your Son. Please work in us by your Spirit as we hear your word read, taught, as we encourage each other with it. Please grow us in our knowledge of your will so that we think, act, and speak in a way that pleases and honours you. Please give us the conviction and courage to make Christ known. In Jesus' name, amen. We'll see you next week.